Whoa. Okay, so we're gonna start the next position in the side control here. So one thing that happens a lot is your opponent will leave their arm exposed like this, on this side of my head. Okay, so don't get it confused. This and this are different. Okay, so today we're talking about when his arm is trapped between my head and his legs. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do, I take my right arm and I secure his arm. If you need, you can even use the other hand. You need to trap his arm right now, it's very important. Don't let it escape. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is post my left hand on the mat. My right hand, I'm gonna lift his arm up and I close my elbow inside. This is really important. Close your elbow and all of your weight is going on that elbow. It's very uncomfortable for the person on bottom. Put all my weight over their ribs. Okay, so now to go to the arm bar, I'm gonna step my left leg up, I'm gonna pass it over his body, and I step with my toes on the mat. Okay, see how my foot is in the same line of his shoulder? This is really important. Also, the detail with my toes on the mat is really important. You're gonna see why in a second. It's going to allow me to pivot my body and sit down for the arm bar. Okay, so now I just hold both hands on his wrist, squeeze my knees together, Pull his arm down and slowly lift my hips up. Always in the arm bar, make sure their thumb is pointing up. Okay, one important detail here when you do an arm bar like this is look at my left foot here. He's at a 45 degree angle under his shoulder. Okay, this will lift his shoulder off of the mat. Now you see when I pinch my knees, look at how high his arm is. It's gonna be very easy to finish. If you don't have this foot in the right position, much more loose. It's gonna be very difficult to submit him here. Okay, so the problem in, with this arm bar is no gi, I have nothing to grab here. And sometimes they can escape by running to their knees like this. Okay, so I'm gonna show you one arm bar I like to do instead. So we're gonna start the same way. I trap his arm, everything is the same. Hold my hand, lift his arm, close my elbow. All of your weight over the ribs, okay? So now what happens when I try to step is, most people know this first arm bar, and their reaction is to block me here so I can't spin around. Okay, let's turn this way so you So, first, look at my right leg. I'm gonna do a little bit of a windshield wiper here so he doesn't trap my leg. Never leave it over here, he can trap my leg. Okay, so I go here, now I take my left hand, push his wrist to the mat, and I trap it with my shin. Now I do the windshield wiper, and I trap it with the other leg. Okay, now his arm is stuck. Okay, so now come around this side so you can see the finish. Instead of passing my leg here and turning, what I'm gonna do is pass it all the way over his body. So look, I just passed my leg here. Now I turn my body and sit down. Now I have the traditional arm bar, both legs over. Same thing, squeeze your knees, control the wrist, make sure the thumb is up. Slowly bring their arm down and lift your hips up. Okay? Let's.